We've infiltrated the G5 building. Awesome stealth roll. And, and, uh, wardrobe change. Yeah, it was a little, they had the heating system, so no need for a trench coat in here. How did the, those guards, oh, now they finally realized it. I actually failed a few times at this mission. As you can see, these guards have cloak. But you can't see their shadow if you're looking hard enough. <laughs> so you just batch slap them. I try to save bullets. <laughs> so yeah. you just the second guard always it. has the key card. Oh, you just had the gangster, didn't you? I have no idea how he survived that headshot. Maybe I shot that gun out of the guy's hand. <laughs> oh, whoopsie! I guess I wasn't happy with that. Now you have to fight the box man. I probably pro okay. I for I didn't realize I uh, cut so many times. So <laughs> now I feel embarrassed. Huh? I keep screwing up. So I keep resetting. Gosh, I didn't realize I left it. I left that stuff in. Now my, now my. I guess I'll just use the phrase "the cat's out of the bag." <laughs> Though that the shooting the gun out of the guy's hand was really impressive. Once again, how did he survive the headshot? I don't know. Maybe he doesn't really have that much of a brain. I always turn the light off. Like because he did the, hear because all if, of... Because if you, do, if you leave the light on, then when you walk in, they turn the lights off and it's a lot harder to see them. So turn it off and then when you go in, they'll turn it on. <laughs> yeah, okay. This time I got four guards. I'm pretty sure last time I played through this, I only had three. I don't know. There's alarms in this level, so if guards see you, they will... Well, the blue vested guards see you, they'll attempt to run for an alarm. And then you'll fail the objective, because the conspirators will be alerted, and they'll call off the meeting. <laughs> I just waited, waited for him to. Well, I didn't want to hit him in his hand or the gun and waste the bullet. <laughs> just being polite. Yeah. Well, like if you see a guard get, ow. That happened the exact same way another time, except I died. Huh. Um, well sometimes, oh yeah, they didn't really see it there. Sometimes guards are already waiting in their firing position, so as soon as they see you, they'll start shooting, which can usually end pretty badly for you. Cheap little buggers. Probably the worst one, if you get caught out in the open, is the firing animation, where they just pull the triggers, they just let go with all the bullets in their clip and while they're walking towards you. Wow. Yeah. Next. Now, the CMP-150 is pre the, the most common gun in the game because for the first... Uh, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Level 6. Oop. Conspiracy plotting time. We've recovered the sapient from Carrington. Does white, one white trench symbol. Symbol. It no longer has a personality, so there will be Oh, he's also got a turtleneck. You know he's the main bad guy. This will reduce its that Look logo, that. that's the Datadyne logo. It's a, it's a lowercase d and an uppercase d with the sharing the same backbone. Uh-huh. That, that's why it looks like that, because Datadyne spelled with a lowercase d and then an uppercase d for dying. I'm so angry, I'm going to keep my fist. Me too. Is that all you can talk about? Yep. Sir, we're angry. The president turned down the request for the lunar Crap, that's so that I'm trying to remember uh, faces of the actors. <laughs> he looks your influence. His voice does not fit his face. No. Whose voice? Whitey's. Oh. I actually to be honest, uh and we will move the the character is known only as Mr. Blonde. <laughs> what? It's because he doesn't actually have a name. They never refer to him by any name, so he's just known as Mr. Blonde. Uh, what's her? Mrs. Blue? No, she's Cassandra DeVries, and the red-suited man is Trent Easton. Uh. He's the director of the NSA. The technology you gave us is installed in the... Conspiracy! <laughs> I did explain how this world works, right? Yeah. 
the so, hyper corpse. Yeah, so anything's possible. Oh, this Look at that. <laughs> Look at- wait, listen to this. That was... Cool. <laughs> Look at that, he wears a trench coat, he wears a turtleneck, and he wears white clothing. He's he, clearly the, bag of, the I baddest actually, guy. The only thing I have to say is that I like his N64 face better. He's a little more blonde, too, instead of white-haired. Kind of gray-white-haired. Look still, at that guy, he's got like a Spanish mustache. <laughs> that guard was killed. <laughs> of course. They're, like they're like just the dirty Mexican. Spaniard. <laughs> oh, oh. So yes, if you're playing without auto aim, this is this is how you play the game. Oh, they're shooting. Hide behind something. <laughs> also, be careful. Bullets will not will send you flying back, and you can get pinned against the wall. No! Well, that's what Joanna Dark gets when all she wears is like skimpy leather clothing. <laughs> My gun. <laughs> you sh hey, even he called you a bitch. Right well, I still, me, like, you bitch. still personally, my favorite, favorite Trish line shot. that they say is, IT'S A TERRORIST! <laughs> Man, I wonder how many nut shots you've gotten in this game. We should keep count. I'm not keeping count of that. And besides, I don't think they're all... Oh look, it's Grimshaw again. Oops. LJ! What'd you do? Um... You know that button that I wasn't supposed to press? Did you hit the red button? No, I, pr I uh, clicked the crimson one next to it. Oh, okay. Yeah, Man, now, they're got in, they're now they're sending in the SWAT troopers. They just, I wonder how many troopers are getting like chopped in half with, through that door. The door must consume all. <laughs> the door is hungry for the flesh of guards. Oh, look at that. The guy lost his head. No, he didn't. Borat. <laughs> the door craves flesh of the living. The door is satisfied for now. <laughs> yeah. Where do you think all the corpses are going? <laughs> <laughs> nom nom nom. Nom 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 nom. The door craves more flesh. Now, you, LJ, can you tell what they're, what these SWAT guards are using, trying to kill me? Uh, I, that's not that's not what I want. They're killing you with horrible tactics. <laughs> it's horrible aim too. I'm getting headshots on these guys left and right. Not just uh, okay, that. time for me to bring out the big guns. And there's one hungry door. Okay, <laughs> hang on, not quite yet. Look at them all. Yes, and they're Door high, and, they, and surprisingly, this is on perfect age, and yes, they keep missing me. I don't know how. I'm surprised because I'd be dead from just a couple of those hits. Well, you know how terrifying. Blow my escape. Is? All right, Magnum time. You know how terrifying it is knowing that your friends are getting eaten. Bam! By the through the door. Bam! <laughs> one shot, one kill. Oh my God, that's Bam. eating them too. Bam! <laughs> there, movement. Don't chase her. <laughs> Yeah, that's a D. That's a, the DY357 Magnum. I don't know how big is that in real life. Oh, 357. Yeah. It's about uh, roughly the same size as a. Uh, it's a uh, wider, slightly wider than. I should just a tiny bit wider than the 38 Special. Look at it. Okay, but anyway, the 357 Magnum will kill a guard in one hit, even a perfect agent. And it goes straight through doors. Oh yeah, 357 is pretty strong, but I don't know about doors. You no, saw but no, no, LJ, literally. The 357 bullet went straight through that metal door of, of flesh eating. <laughs> That's impossible. That door is impenetrable. <laughs> it went straight through the door. But that door is fueled by hate. I killed and hunger. 55 guards. And had their bodies uh, conveniently destroyed from the. By that I'm door. infiltrating Area 51, and apparently we're not going to protect the president. At least Ew. not yet. You're trying to quarantine that door. That <laughs> door is pure <laughs> evil. Because the craft carrying Carrington's friends got shut down over Area 51. Happened. Wait, which, what would which they do? Which conveniently also is the same place, which is in Nevada. Which is the same place conveniently Trent Easton was talking about they installed some fancy new equipment from Mr. Blonde. But wait, one thing. I don't think... People take like a little stroll over Area 51, so 
Yes, but this is Joanna Dark. Oh. Remember, we just we just killed 55 guards. Ah, uh, 55 guards without any effort. And that doesn't include the fact that we've uh, cut our way through a back alley of Chicago and also through Data Dine headquarters already. And pretty much did anything you want because you're Joanna friggin' Dark. I think that's usually applied to Gary Oak. Except uh, not in nearly as good a sense. Gary, actually, it's usually a stronger expletive than that. Gary motherfucking Oak. And he went there, LJ. What name is Gary? <laughs> That's a real name. I know, but my name, your arch nemesis, arch nemesis Gary. At least make fun of him, like <laughs> Gary, not like Pecker, like Peckerhead Oak, or uh. Well, look at it this way: in the manga, because they take from the games a little more seriously, <laughs> the characters are red and blue. All the main characters are named after the game names. Wait, so so there's a guy named Silver. Yeah, that's the uh, the jerk face from the second generation games. If you've ever seen him, the red who names, guy. Who names their children after colors? Ah, it's just a thing. It's uh, saves them actually coming up with a name for them by just naming them after the games in the manga. 